my goodness. Hi. Is that you? Oh my goodness. I'm so excited to see you. Friends, look. Pi is back. Yes. We're very excited to have you, Pi. Where have you been? You were at the school initially, and then you had to go on a secret science mission in an underground laboratory. And that's all you can tell me or else you would have to kill me. Oh my goodness. Well, it sounds like Pi had a super exciting summer. Would you like to see our science experiment from yesterday? Okay, beautiful. So we have this bubble solution on this plate and we were blowing bubbles to see how long they lasted. So watch. Oh no, wait, it's not working. You're right, Pi. Oh. Wait, this plate had bubble solution in it yesterday, but now it's just soap. What happened to all of the water from our bubble solution? Huh. I wonder. You know what? I wonder if we can take this wondering and turn it into a testable question. I think so too. Okay. Okay, so to figure out where the water from our bubble solution went, let's ask ourselves a testable question. Let's ask ourselves, how will an airtight lid affect water sitting in a container? Does that sound like a good testable question to you? Beautiful. So let's put water in two separate containers, one with a lid and one without a lid, and we can compare and see what happens after one week. So this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to fill them up almost all of the way. And then I'm going to take a dry erase marker and I'm going to mark the water level. So here's my dry erase marker. I'm going to mark exactly where that water level is. One, two, and I'm going to put a container only on one of these. And then I'm going to place them right next to each other in the exact same spot because the variable right now is the lid and the constants are everything else. So everything else needs to stay the same. What do you think will happen after we leave both of these containers for one week? How will the container without a lid look different from the container with the lid? Put your hypothesis in the comments and I can't wait to see you next week.